Hello, in this video, we're going to find the derivative of f of x equals 1 over 2x using the definition of the derivative. Let's go ahead and work through it very carefully. Solution. So the definition of the derivative is the following. So f prime of x is equal to the limit as h approaches 0 of f of x plus h minus f of x, and all of this is being divided by h. So if this limit exists, we say it is the derivative of the function. So this is equal to the limit as h approaches 0. Let's work out f of x plus h. So f of x is 1 over 2x. So f of x plus h, it's the same thing except you replace x with x plus h. So it's 1 over 2 parentheses x plus h. And we have the minus, and then we have f of x, which is just 1 over 2x. All of this is being divided by little h. I'm going to go ahead and put parentheses in the numerator. They were already there in the previous step. They were just implied. But since now we're going to have a fraction over a fraction, it just helps to have the parentheses there for clarity. Okay, let's keep going. This is equal to the limit as h approaches 0. And there's a couple ways to do the subtraction here. Um, one way to do it is just to basically use the product of these two as the LCD. So we're looking for the LCD of 2x plus h and 2x. So you can just take 2x, x plus h, or you can just take the product. Let's go ahead and use this as the LCD. So I'm going to write it down. 2x, x plus h. And then it's going to be 1 times what's missing here to get the LCD. So we're missing just the x because we already have the 2 in the x plus h. So x minus and then 1 times what's missing here to get the LCD. Well, we already have the 2 in the x. So we just need the x plus h. This entire top piece is in parentheses, and this is all over h. All right, continuing, this is equal to the limit as h approaches 0. So now we can distribute here and cancel. So we've got x minus x. Those are going to go away. We're just left with minus h. We have minus h over 2x, parentheses, x plus h. And all of this is in parentheses, and it's all being divided by h. Very nice. So this is equal to the limit as h approaches 0. So now we have this fraction, and it's being divided by h. You can really think of this as h over 1. So when you divide, you really multiply by the reciprocal. So this is, will be negative h over 2x, x plus h, and then times 1 over h. Because we, when we divide, we multiply by the reciprocal. These cancel, and so this is equal to the limit as h approaches 0 of negative 1 over, and we have 2x and then x plus h. And we finally reached a point where we can actually evaluate the limit. We can plug in 0 for h. When you do that, that's when you drop the limit sign. So we have negative 1 over 2x, parentheses, x plus 0. That's just going to be negative 1 over 2x squared, which is the final answer. So really not too bad. You just basically go through go through it, start with your um, definition, and then just carefully uh, go through the steps. I hope this video has been helpful. Good luck.